In this video, we're going to go over disproportionation reactions. Disproportionation reactions are a special case of redox reactions where atoms in one oxidation state are simultaneously oxidized and reduced. So usually when we look at redox reactions, it's usually one atom gets oxidized and a different atom gets reduced. In a disproportionation reaction, the same atom gets oxidized and reduced. Let's take a look at an example. So here, we have two molecules of hydrogen peroxide reacting to form two molecules of water and oxygen. If we take a look at the oxidation states, we can see that hydrogen starts with an oxidation state of plus one. There are two hydrogens, so they're both plus one. But in both the reactants and the products, hydrogen, its oxidation state does not change. So essentially hydrogen isn't actually participating in this redox reaction and is essentially a spectator ion. If we take a look at oxygen though, in hydrogen peroxide, oxygen has an oxidation state of minus one. If we take a look at water, oxygen has an oxidation state of minus two, and in O2, oxygen has an oxidation state of zero. So you can see in the reactants, oxygen has an oxidation state of minus one. But in the products, some of the oxygens have an oxidation state of minus two, and others have an oxidation state of zero. So the ones that went into water got reduced. They gained an electron. The ones that went into O2 got oxidized. They lost an electron. So again, one atom in one oxidation state is simultaneously reduced and oxidized. So that's what a disproportionation reaction is.